Hello my friends, welcome back, it's episode 8. Let's proceed. <clears throat> With the mission. <clears throat> I don't think the colonies can ever actually die. <clears throat> I hear that they can defect. <clears throat> but you can get them back by basically sitting a fleet over them. <clears throat> I should go and get my Mark II Vipers soon. Alright, what a beautiful fleet. <clears throat> So many adamants. Fleet group is jumping in three, two, one. And of course, the enemy can just jump in anywhere. It's like a total pain in the ass. Dratus contacts. Marks are confirmed hostile. I'll tell you how this will go. They're either all flak frigates. On it, Commander. And I will very quickly be running away with my fighters. Or they're not all flak frigates and my fighters are gonna eat them alive. Squadron on me. But what I do know is that I have to go through the ritual of lowering my height, as usual, because the enemy are below me. Yes, sir. Not that I suppose fire height fire. actually really applies in uh, space, but you know. Okay, I could do with being a little bit lower. Understood. IFF confirms unit is hostile. Oh, it's a flat frigate. Let's see how he handles an entire horde, though. Fire everything at this guy. And focus fire him. And turn to give him the broadside. Missiles incoming! Nothing but the rain. Why did you fire like that? Well, it doesn't matter. IFF confirms unit is hostile. <clears throat> Go for the front and most. So say we all. Let's curve them in. Squadron. Goodbye, Talon. <clears throat> Splat. Splat. It's like my fighters made short work of that. Uh, nothing really screams I'm a priority target. Oh, 
There's a whole lot of shooting going on. Actually, fire at that one. Yes, sir. Some of you need to turn this way. Understood. Just can't let that guy get away. In case he starts going after my space station. He's basically done no damage. Okay, turn around. On it, Commander. For whatever reason, this. This one here has gone high. Wow, he's just getting pummeled. These guys are just totally and utterly outgunned. Yes, sir. Okay, the fighters will actually clean up what's left now. Stupid dust nebula is, uh... Destroying my ability to actually target this idiot. So say we all. I'm pretty sure that, that Nemesis has got the fighter ball after it, so he'll uh, be gone very shortly. Missiles incoming! Shoot him, please. There we go, he's nearly gone. And so is he. More maneuverable, but not better. <clears throat> All contacts down. Mission complete. All right, show me the money. Hundred to jump now. Oh, painful. 
it'd be cheaper to rush new ships and jump them. Do those populations ever change? No clue. The only thing I know for certain is I need to burn time until my jump drives cost less to use. Frigate is ready for orders. Okay. A 3000 strength fleet. Not bad. But still not good enough. These fleets are actually pretty big and, pr and pretty strong. 320 to jump. We have a new mission, Commander. Two hundred and forty. Okay, it's starting to drop. And this one's down to 90. Okay, this will be the last turn I land Cylon here. Cylon escort group has been detected. Huh, one appeared over here. A fortified colony is under attack. All right, sweet. I'll leave this fleet behind to guard this uh, area once the extra adamant has been added. Then it will be realistically as powerful as it's going to get <clears throat> without uh, an upgraded officer. Oh, it's a tiny fleet. Viper food. Yes, sir. That tiny fleet is Viper Dinner. I don't care what it what it is. It could all be flak frigates, it's not gonna matter. Understood. Off you go. So say we all. Man, Mark II Vipers will... Uh, I don't know how much they improved the standard ones, but... Uh, standard Vipers are pretty sweet, so... Uh, Mark IIs might be even better. Nope, just missile frigs. Missiles incoming. Turn. Turn. And everyone launch against that guy, and that's it. Splat. Shame the adamant's got weak front armor. It's about the only thing I don't like about it. <clears throat> no 
Okay, the fighters ate one, the missiles ate another. And that just leaves the nemesis. It's over. My smaller fleet probably could have handled that, to be fair. That's as big as that fleet is going to get. Even more fleet points doesn't seem necessary right now. Speaking of officers, navigation subsystem strength, elevation control, flagship only, hangar subsystem strength. Maybe I should train up a new officer actually on the main fleet. Do you know what? I would like to keep the guy with the hangar strength ability. I'm sure we'll get some serious uh, carriers in the future. That would be quite useful. Okay. 160 for the jump. Thirty-six. All right. So you can now, for 160, jump here. Go and kill that, and you should be strong enough to live without me. No, um, to take this fleet. Cylon escort group has been detected. Set condition one throughout the station. Fleet group, Daedalus is under attack. Ha, huh, the other one ran away. Okay, I think we can go chasing the plot after this. The Cylon fleets are either thinning, they're thinning out. Or they're just not appearing here anymore. I think we've finally reached the point that we've put the hurt on them. What is that? Prepare There's no problem you can't solve with two. wave after wave of vipers, right? Yes, sir. Launch the squads. Not sure what the research station is in aid of.
Yes, Commander. I don't know how many flat frigates they've got, but uh, I don't care. Send them in. Yes, sir. Ships are expensive. The Vipers cost nothing. Okay, well, we know for a fact that there's enemy carriers. Yes, sir. Go for their fires first. Keep losing altitude, boys. Fighter squadron is taking fire. Hostile unit identified. Uh, you, 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 and you can launch. You two are too close. So say we all. On it, Commander. Yes, sir. To the fleet. It may result in friendly fire. Missiles incoming! Secondary battery. Full attack. Button. Hostile unit identified. Adjusting shot by point one six. Fire. Just you. Slow right down. So as not to stray into each Understood. other's firing solutions. On it, Commander. So say we all. Understood. On it, Commander. Great, great, great. Switching guns to manual. Keep your target locked and watch the clearing. Break. Or peel, I should say. Okay, fighters are still very much alive. Yes, sir. On it, Commander. And he's dead. <clears throat> yes, Commander. Yes, sir. Yes, Commander. Keep going, boys. They always go after the ones they think have the lowest uh, hit points. Missiles away, boys. Missiles away. Yes, Commander. That is not what we want. Daedalus is under 
attack. Yeah, that's fine. We're coming back. We're coming back. On it, Commander. It can be repaired. I find there's no need to change uh, posture or anything like that at the moment. Okay, he's got a horde of fighters chasing him. And he's very badly damaged. I really hate these things. Serastes or whatever, Serestes. They're so fast, they've got great firepower, they're really maneuverable. I mean, they just, they don't really have any disadvantages. And they're a total pain in the ass to catch. Oh, the fires are turning him into mincemeat right now. <clears throat> Ironically, the space station's actually doing some damage here. Nice. Finally, we cleared this area. So say we all. We're back up to 400 to jump. Not interested in paying 400 to jump. But I'll be headed back there shortly. Cylon strike group has been detected. New adamant has been deployed. Okay. Jump there to join that group. Hmm, 320 to jump. Cancel. Hmm, that's a big fleet. Number 18. Man, I need to wait many turns now to actually cool off my drives enough for them to not cost a ridiculous amount of money to, to use. Detected a Cylon escort fleet, sir.
Okay. <clears throat> that fleet will get bigger once the commander has some experience. Which he'll get if he finds a small fleet to attack. But both of these fleets are pretty big. Okay, I need to go over there and deal with that. It didn't really take much for them to defect. <laughs> These guys have been under siege like forever and they held out really well. These guys have a fleet next to them for two turns and they defect. Sure, why not? <sighs> Basically, this officer needs to level up before I can actually merge this fleet properly. Both these fleets are too big to attack without taking huge risk. That Cylon Fleet 20 is not very big. You know, I could send this fleet. I kind of want to carry on with the story though. Go for it. Frigate is ready for orders. Jump to here. Four hundred to jump now. Ugh, so painful. But fine. Whoa, 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 You are supposed to be going here. That is correct. One of our allies is being attacked. Okay, the moment I moved was the moment he moved to over here. That's a small fleet, though. Uh, this fleet is number 44. 44? Are they got 44 fleets out there? And it's big, too. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. So 44 is uh, uh, 2,750 and this fleet is 4,000. 
Oh, this guy might finally be able to get some uh, experience. Okay, and as for you, just carry on. Carry on pumping these frigates out. They should recover from defection, I believe. Set condition one throughout fleet. Apparently. Lost colonies recover over time. Okay, there's the enemy ball. Probably the same thing as usual. Jumping in three. That they're below two, me. One. What are these? stat bonuses that I'm not even sure they really matter that much. Anyway, that enemy fleet is like really, 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 really underneath me. Launching alert vipers. Yes, Commander. Going down. Taking fire. All right, boys. Take him down. Squadron target is confirmed. It's a load of flak frigates. Smack them down. On it, Commander. On it, Commander. Yes, Commander. This one's dead. Fortunately, these things have got so amazing rear armor, so 
there's no problem with showing my backside to the enemy here while I maneuver. So say we all. Collision detected. Yes, sir. I'm just waiting for my missiles to recharge so I can volley another ship to Mantor bits. Is taking damage. So say we all. Keep turning, boys. They'll definitely go after the Manticores because the Manticores are the weakest units. We are still waiting for their missiles to recharge. Squadron has gone dark. Yes, Commander. Squadron target is confirmed. Firing missiles at the one that's chasing. He'll walk right into them. Oh, if you don't friendly fire them into the guy, though. <laughs> oh well. Yeah, that definitely hurt. Yes, sir. They're chasing after the Manticores. Because the Manticores are weak. Manticores taking damage. But he should die before the Manticore does. Manticore is taking damage. Wow, he hits really hard and fast, though. Where's the other one, too? They're, like, all the way over there. That's fine. On it, Commander. Are the launchers ready yet? Nope, but we can focus fire his ass. He'll immediately aim for the manticores because they're they're so hurt. Time for big Russian missiles. How about that? On it, Commander. Uh. 
Understood. You two just fly off into the sunset together. We have two enemy ships left to deal with. They are over here. Understood. Say we all. Missiles ready? Nope, not yet. Oh, they switched targets to this one. Although, actually, he's tougher. So that doesn't really make sense, but okay. We'll aim missiles at the tougher one to blast through. The weaker one is going down. Adamant is taking damage. Oh wow, they did actually manage to carve through his his leftermost hull. is taking damage. Turn, turn, turn. Yes, Commander. Okay, I'm just gonna burn time until my missiles are ready again. So maneuverable, it's like really annoying. I guess that one's the closest one. Wow, that hull is really in a bad way. <laughs> yes, sir. Turn around, I might actually need you. Adamant is taking damage. Optimizing firing solution. Smash him! Is about all this guy's got. Ready for 
We're taking fire. Adamant is taking damage. God damn, these boys have got so much firepower. It is insane. I need every ship in this fight. Okay, it's only the left side that's damaged on this one. Let's try and hide that. Adamant is taking damage. Rear armor is all I have. Yes, this one's only got right side armor. Adamant is taking damage. Alright guys, you've all got full rear armor. On it, Commander. Not much else. Let's go. Let's run. Just run away until your missiles recharge. And throw missiles at them while they chase. That would be the effective way to deal with these. They're too maneuverable. And they seem to have superior range, so they're just kiting me. They can waste time while I recharge my launchers on it commander system repairs underway might as well might as well fire solution is online prepare mode mark one eyeball in got one Oh, please don't tell me that's on target. No, of course not. That would be a weird... A weird miracle for the enemy. gonna run away and fire missiles, run away and fire missiles, run away and fire missiles. Because those things have just got me outperformed. Subsystem is back online. And he's gonna run straight into it. Although he does have some front armor, but it's not gonna be enough to resist all these missiles. Got him. God, those things, they're gonna be high priority targets from now on because they're really a pain in the ass. They're extremely good against fighters and they're also tough, 
fast and loads of firepower. They don't seem to take much effort to be good. They seem to have good firepower in all directions. Okay, good. Good work, boys. You didn't let me down. I'll be able to merge these fleets together. Uh, well, not necessarily merge them, but anyway. Detach. Oh, it's quite tricky actually. Set condition one throughout fleet. Eh, I can't even be bothered to load up the battle to actually do that. Wait a minute. Did I jump the wrong ship? Wow, it actually cost a lot to repair that. <sighs> hang on, hang on, hang on. Sagittarians back on its feet. And in theory, this fleet should move here and then should be available Detected for the attack. Strike fleet, sir. Chance to win 100%, chance of casualties 0. But apparently, if you auto resolve, you don't get any experience points. So let's just clean this up quickly and then uh, we'll call it. Fleet group is jumping in three. Two, one. 
Okay. What? What? So it costs quite a lot to repair spare fleets. Understood. All right. Send in the swarm. Understood. The Overmind will rule this day. Annoyingly, I don't have a lock on any enemies, so I can't launch missiles yet. Well, we know what they are. Fighter squadron is taking fire. Missiles incoming. I don't normally do this, but hey. Hostile unit identified. Slow down a bit, buddy. Ouch. Evil little hacker ships, but I certainly much prefer them to those flat frigates, that's for sure. They're defenseless against fires. They haven't even managed to get a single fire kill. And there goes the rear armor. Guy is being nailed to a wall. That got a little messy. Pop. Nice. He leveled up. Woohoo! For promotion yet. This guy is not ready for promotion yet either. Okay, this is kind of just like a spare ship then. So I don't regret doing that. A political rally has been attacked by a roving Cylon fleet. Evacuate the civilians to safety. Don't, you don't know like attacked by a roving Cylon fleet. You don't know the uh, the strength of um, 
the enemy with those. More things have appeared that I might requisition, but I'm not allowed to requisition. I guess this is locked by mission five, mission five, mission five, mission five. Well, mission five is right there. And my engines have actually cooled off quite a bit. But the funny part is, the engines, they stack. So it's kind of like... Um, they go all the way down to like 30. And then, you know, the next jump is 60, 90, 120, 160. And then it starts really ramping up. But at the moment, it's going in the other direction. So... I was just sitting here and uh, fixing the political situation in Sagittarian. next thing I should do actually is this fleet no not this fleet this fleet that's only got one one dude should head on over this way and should hang around the uh, the shipyard And everybody else should just sit where they are for now. And I'm going to hit this mission next. Because that's going to unlock some new stuff for me, I'm sure. I don't know anything about this mission. A political rally has been attacked by a roving Cylon fleet. Just the rewards the are listed. Safety. But who knows what the potential enemies are, so... We'll have to uh, think about it. But anyway, what's critical for me is to do this story mission now and actually unlock good, good equipment, so... That is it for now. I hope you guys enjoyed it, and I'll see you guys next time.